This video is in memory of the actor Tony Dow, who passed away July 27, 2022. Stay tuned for comments after the video. It's an MTV feature presentation. Uh, gee, babe, I don't know if you should be hitting this. MTV presents, from the new Leave it to Beaver, Tony Dow, Barbara Billingsley, and me, Jerry Mathers, as the Beaver. I'm uh, Tony Dow, Wallace Cleaver from the new Leave it to Beaver show, and this is Jerry Mathers, who plays my younger brother, Theodore. <laughs> hey, Tony, how come you're being so formal? You, well, I don't know. I mean, I, I think everybody still thinks of us as little kids and saying dumb stuff like golly wally and gee beave. I mean, we're grown up now. We have kids of our own. Truer words were never spoken, but this is MTV. <laughs> Loosen up. We're here to party. <laughs> well, I guess you're right, Jerry. No, I'm ready to rock. Me too. As your MTV guest VJs tonight, we'll be playing some of your favorite videos, including Daryl Hall, Billy Joe, and Alice Cooper. And we're going to start things off right now with another bunch of guys who had their own TV hit show back in the 60s, and now they're back and on the charts. Here's the Monkees with a song that we can certainly relate to. That was then, and this is now. Ready? You gotta go like this. Ready? Go. That was then. This was now. I can't the do monkeys. that. The <laughs> No, I was just thinking. No, what? You know, if we'd have had MTV when we were kids, you know, I'll bet you we wouldn't have gotten in so much trouble. Yeah, well, I know what you mean, but um, you gotta think about it this way. If um, we hadn't gotten in so much trouble, the old Leave it to Beaver wouldn't have been such a big hit, and then we wouldn't be here doing the new Leave it to Beaver, which, uh, incidentally, we have some clips from that you're gonna take a look at later on. Plus, we have a lot more of our favorite videos, so stick around. <laughs> Wally, I told you last week that it was ridiculous for a boy your age to start shaving before he even had a beard. Now, I'll tell you once more, stop trying to act so grown up. <laughs> Speaker. Speaker. Uh, receiver. Receiver. Television. Television? Now your stereo system's complete. MTV Music Television. Hi, we're the Cleavers, and we're your guest VJs on MTV tonight. Hi, boys. Oh, hi, Mom. Am I interrupting anything? No, of course not. Come on, sit down. Thank you. You all uh, remember our mom, June Cleaver, better known as Barbara Billingsley. You know, a lot of people have been wondering what we'd be like as grown-ups. Well, in the new show on WTBS, we answer all those questions. I'm a businessman, and June is a city councilwoman. Yeah, but she still makes the best cookies in town. Oh, Wally, you haven't done too badly as a lawyer. No. Now, you take a look at the clips from this new Leave it to Beaver show. You'll find out that things haven't totally changed. <laughs> I hope I didn't wreck your case for you, but I just couldn't take it when that other attorney insulted my integrity. I understand, but an expert witness loses credibility when he stamps his feet and yells, liar, liar. <laughs> yeah, you had a burglar alarm. I know, and it's my beat. <laughs> What did I tell you? The more things change, the more they stay the same. Like ever since there's been rock and roll, there's been teen idols like James Dean and Elvis Presley, and now there's Charlie Sexton. He just turned 18. Yeah. I remember when I was a teenager. Wally, everyone remembers you as a teenager. <laughs> <laughs> Here's Hold Me from Charlie Sexton. understood it all then let me explain some folks have a strange idea of entertainment one of the hottest rumors of the 70s was that eddie haskell from our show grew up to be alice cooper mm. 
Come to think of it, Ken Osmond, who played Eddie Haskell, never actually denied that rumor to me. What about to you? Yeah, now that you mention it, hey. I, how can you guys compare that face to this face? You guys are dopier than I thought. Eddie, what are you doing here? Well, I didn't want you two making total fools of yourself on MTV. So I thought I'd swing by and add a little Haskell charm to help bail you guys out. You know, Eddie, we loved you in your new video, The Man Behind the Mask. Yeah, that black mascara bit. Looking great. Look, you guys know that I am not Alice Cooper. I have never been Alice Cooper. I never will be Alice Cooper. Now, will you tell the folks out there, I am not Alice Cooper. We'll be right back. Alice Cooper. Well, good afternoon, Mrs. Cleaver. My, that's a lovely babushka you're wearing. I didn't hear the doorbell. I didn't ring it. Here's some flowers for my best friend's mother. <sighs> I'd tell that to Lumpy's mother, too, but I don't mean it. Since a lot of you guys out there want to know what we've been doing in the years between Leave It to Beaver and our new show, we're going to fill you in. At one time, I had my own band, and we released a few records. We called ourselves Beaver and the Trappers. I think it's queued up. Let's give a listen. Happiness is being, being left alone. Besides uh, <clears throat> doing that, I also had my own radio show. I called it The Jerry Mathers Gathers with Rock and Roll for the Mind, Body, and Soul. Barbara Billingsley's been in many TV shows and a couple movies, including her classic jive talk from Airplane. Hang in there, blood. We're going to catch up on the rebound on the mid-side. <laughs> <laughs> and you know, Tony, he's done a whole slew of roles in TV and movies. He's not too bad as a sculptor and a designer. Oh, well, gee, thanks, Mom. I mean, June. <laughs> I mean, Barbara. <laughs> oh, and um, Ken Osman over here, he's done all sorts of things. He's been an officer on the LAPD, and he's uh, played the shop teacher on the Happy Days. Yeah, but we're all back together now. And we're so happy about it, we could dance on the ceiling, which is exactly what Lionel Richie does in his latest video. <laughs> and it's coming up right after this break. Your father's out, huh? Yeah, him and Mama talk of building lots. Then what are you worried about? You just roll it down, don't say nothing. That looks pretty good, Eddie. Yeah, but Eddie, sooner or later they're gonna roll up the window. What do we do then? You just look surprised and say, gee, Dad, I wonder how that could have happened. What are you doing? It's the monkey marathon! I'm doing the no, monkey no, marathon. No, no, sorry, wrong marathon. Huh? Wrong marathon. It's not that kind of marathon. No, no, no. This is the monkey marathon. Forty episodes of the monkeys back to back. It starts Saturday night and doesn't stop till you've seen all your favorite episodes 20 hours later. Mickey, Davey, and Peter take a break from their sold-out tour to host MTV's Monkey Marathon. Saturday night after the Hooters concert, 2 a.m. Eastern, 1 a.m. Central, and all day Sunday. Oh, a virtual Disneyland for shut-ins. Hi, Tony Dow here and my little brother, Jerry Mathers, and we're here tonight as your uh, guest VJs on MTV. Now, our next video is Lionel Richie's Dancing on the Ceiling. So what do you think of this clip? Well, I was just thinking, mm -hmm. before we played Billy Joel, now we're playing Lionel Richie. Those are both guys whose last names are first names, too. <laughs> Was that it? I mean, don't you want to know how they got Lionel and uh, all those guys to dance on the ceiling? You know, like that old movie, what was it, that Fred Astaire thing with, um... Royal Wedding, 1951. Yeah, you're right. How'd you know that? I watched my MTV. Here's Lionel Richie with Dancing on the Ceiling. Hey, go ahead, Jerry. Do that uh, VJ DJ thing you do so well. Oh, thanks, Tony. We just saw Follow Me from R.E.M. The band's in the middle of a U.S. tour right now. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I think we better put some reins on a beef here. He's getting a little too much into this MTV VJ thing. And your mother, forget it. I just caught her in a green room, and she was dancing to heavy metal music. Oh, good evening, Mrs. Cleaver. I was just remarking to Wallace and young Theodore here what a fine taste you have in music. Put a sock in it, Eddie. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> All right. You see, mother does know best. <laughs> well, now, you just stay around, and we're going to wind things up right away with Daryl Hall right after this. Catch you on the flip side. <laughs> Tonight's guest VJ Hour is sponsored by Levi's Buttonfly 501 Jeans, Miller Lite Beer, Today's Chevrolet, and by Wendy's.
We just watched a few clips of Tony Dow from 1986 when he was a guest VJ on MTV with other Leave It to Beaver cast members. This was at a time when he was acting in a revival series of Leave It to Beaver. The revival series started on the Disney Channel in 1984 as Still the Beaver, based on the successful TV movie of the same name that had aired on CBS in 1983. After the Disney Channel canceled the series in 1985, it was picked up by Superstation WTBS, who gave it another three seasons as the new Leave it to Beaver. This video is a good example of how MTV presented its programming back in the 1980s through channel IDs and bumpers, but it also shows how they often presented special themed programming blocks featuring well-known personalities. In this case, it's the cast of Leave it to Beaver. There's also another promo included in this video for another one of these special themed programming blocks featuring the cast of the classic TV show The Monkees. Personally, I prefer this version of MTV the most, but maybe that's because it's the version I grew up with. In later years, MTV dropped airing music videos for the most part in favor of broadcasting original programming and series. I picked this video as a tribute to the life of Tony Dow because it includes clips of his work from the 1950s up through the 1980s, and they're being presented by him as Tony Dow and not Wally Cleaver. Although when you watch the video, you can see the lines between the real actors and their on-screen personas was quite blurred for this presentation on MTV. Tony Dow had a long career in acting after Leave it to Beaver, appearing in such TV shows as My Three Sons, Adam 12, General Hospital, Quincy, Knight Rider, Square Pegs, Charles in Charge, Murder, She Wrote, and Diagnosis Murder. He also appeared in a few films that borrowed from his Wally persona, like Kentucky Fried Movie, Back to the Beach, and Dickie Roberts, former child star. Tony Dow also became a director in the 1990s and directed many episodes of well-known TV shows like Star Trek Deep Space Nine, Babylon 5, Get a Life, Harry and the Hendersons, and Coach. But it was his art he wanted to be known for in recent years. Dow was a passionate sculptor who attained worldwide recognition in 2008 when his sculptures were shown at the Société Nationale des Beaux Arts exhibition located in the Carousel de Louvre, Paris, France. Dow was one of three sculptures chosen to receive the honor. Tony Dow died at age 77 on July 27, 2022, roughly three months after having been diagnosed with liver cancer. Those are my comments for this video. If you like these retro videos, please subscribe. Give this video a thumbs up, click the notification bell, and leave a comment. All these things really help the channel. Keep watching for more retro videos like this and other retro themed videos like Retro Talk. Take care of yourself and look out for others. Talk to you later. Bye. This video brought to you by Stockagogo.com. Stock photos.